shut up or what? <laughs> As we learn from the Clovers, gun violence happens in the Bronx. Like, That's what it also it happens like, oh, in dang. Chicago, Memphis, Las Vegas. It happens in cities. It happens on the streets. It also happens in shopping malls, nightclubs. On February 14th, 17 people were shot and killed at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. One of them was freshman, Alex Schachter. A few weeks before, he wrote a poem called Life is Like a Roller Coaster. It is our honor to share it now. Life is like a roller coaster. It has some ups and downs. Sometimes you can take it slow or very fast. It may be hard to breathe at times, but you just have to push yourself and keep going. Your bar is your safety. It's like your family and friends. You hold on tight and don't let go, but sometimes you might throw your hands up because your friends and family will always be with you. Just like that bar, keeping you safe at all times. It may be too much for you at times. The twists, the turns, the upside downs. But you get back up and you keep chugging along. Eventually, it all comes to a stop. You won't know when or how, but you will know that it will be time to get off and start anew. Life is like a roller coaster. We day. Please join us in welcoming Alex's family who is here with us tonight. Thank you to everyone here at We Day for being the leaders of this generation. 
This country is led by people like us who take initiative and bring the change that others are unwilling to bring about. You know, our school went through a terrible tragedy, and the community was deeply hurt, but the students rose up in a way that we've never seen before. From the first day, people told us we couldn't change things. We were just kids who needed to sit down and listen to the adults. It was in saying no that we learned just how much we could do if we worked together, no matter how young we are. And there were times when we thought we were fighting a battle that we were doomed to lose, and our friends would go unremembered. But it was by sticking with each other that we were able to create the march. We as students are the future. We strive to move forward to make this world a better place. One of the strongest ways to do that is with a vote, which not all of us have yet. Matter of fact, raise your hand if you will not be able to vote in this coming election. Everybody. And you know what? That is totally fine. Because for every vote you can't cast, you have family members, friends, and neighbors that you can inspire. You can inspire them to vote for your safety. Yeah. You know, starting school clubs or local activist groups can make a major impact. All you need I to do is have the belief well, that you can make a difference. Thank you, Lee Day. of the events that shocked America at Columbine High School in 1999. Now, you and your classmates are probably not old enough to remember that day, but... Of course we weren't. We weren't even born. Your generation is demanding accountability, <laughs> and you're demanding change, and I personally thank you for that. And I want to thank all of you all of you for, 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 for your power, for your strength, for your perseverance. And because when young people realize that they, they have a voice and when, and when they use your voice, people do listen. Your voices matter, so just keep 